Assalamu alaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Welcome to the next episode. Um, it's been a while. For you guys, you're probably going to get all of them at once. But for me and Esnaf, I don't think we've read for a week. I've been traveling. So we're going to do some, I don't, uh, we'll do some review quickly, just for you, sister, quickly. Do it from here to here. Just these last three lines. Go ahead. Off. Mm -hmm. Wow. Off. Wow. Oh, wow. No, wow. 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 Yeah. Fair. Wow. Fair. Off. Lam. Very good. Off. Fair. Lam. Very good. Yeah, fair. Mean, mean. Ha, mean. Lam, ha. I mean, so. Lam, mean. Very good to mean. Ta, mean. Ta, mean, ta. Excellent. What's this thing called? The squiggly line? A, uh, med. Med. Excellent. All right. Go ahead, sister. Let's see if you remember how to do. You can start from here. Go ahead. Do these three letters. Okay. Spell them. Spell them out. Ain. Mm -hmm. Ah. No. Did you say the fatha on top of the ain? You have to say the fatha. Okay. Ain. This is called the fatha. Okay. This little line on top. Ain fatha ah. Oh, okay. Ain fatha ah. Uh, Ain kasra e Ain dhamma u. Very good. And then all three together. A e ru. A e ru. Okay. That's enough. You can do the next one. Ha fat ha 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 kasra he ha dhamma hu. Mm -hmm. Ha, hey, ho. Okay. Sister? Go ahead. Rain. Oh, make it heavier. Rain. Rain. Fatha. Ra. Mm -mm, it's heavy. Ra. Ra. Rain, Kasra, Ri, Rain, Ra, Ra, Rain, Rain, Damar, Ra. Damar makes it usam. Ru. Oh, yeah. Ru. But try to gargle it so. Ru. Ru. Okay, all three now. Ra, ri. Not re. Don't make it like re. No. Ra. Ra. Ri. Ru. Ra. Ra, ri, ru. Okay, that's enough. Next one. Ha. Let me see. Make it heavy. Ha, fat, ha. Ha. Mm-mm. Ha, fat, ha, ha. It's heavy. It has to have that aw oh sound. Ha, ha, aw, ha, fat, ha, ha. Oh. ha. Again. Ha, fat, ha, ha. Ha, kasra, chi. Ha, dama, ru. Not ru. Don't, don't gargle it. You gargle it a little. Straight up scratching. Ru, ru. Khu, kha, khi, khu. Okay, sister. Kha, Mm-hmm. Fatha, kha. Mm-mm. Heavy. Kha, fatha. Even with the fatha. Okay. So, basically, and I didn't explain this last time. And this might be what is confusing you. Okay. Fatha makes an ah sound. 
right? That's what we agreed. Fatha makes an A sound. Yeah. Kasra makes an E sound. Dhamma makes an U sound. Now, for the light letters, it stays A, okay? As in A, Ha, A. But when you add the A sound to a heavy letter, it gets fused with that A sound. So it's not a clear A anymore, okay? So for example, Kha, Fatha, it becomes Kha, Fatha, Kha, not Kha. We don't, it's not an A plus Kha anymore. Okay, it's not kha, because that would just be like kha. You still have to maintain the heaviness of the kha, which is the aw sound, kha, and then you add the a sound to it. So it's not fully a anymore. Now it's kha, kha, okay? So with the heavy letters, it still is a a sound, okay, but fused with the heaviness. So it becomes kha, qa, ba, ta, sa. Okay, oh, it still has that aw oh sound with the fatha. Okay, so qaf, fatha, aw, oh, not ka, ka, ka. No, it's not light, heavy. Qaf, fatha, qa. Okay, go ahead, do all three now. Qaf, start again from the beginning. Qaf, fatha, qa. Qa, kasra. The letter is called, the letter is called qaf with an F. You have to say qaf, fatha, qa. Qaf, Kasra, Qi, Qaf, Dhamma, Qu. Don't make it long. Don't say Qu. Try to make it just Qu. Qu. All three together. Qa, Qi, Qu. Okay, that's enough. Kaf, Fatha, Ka. Kaf. Kasra ki, kaf dhamma ku, ka ki ku. Very good. Okay, sister. We're right here. Is that qa? No. Ba? Forgot that. We already said So you know what? I saw a picture yesterday that really helped me with this letter. And... Um, let me see if I can, if it's synced, if I can find it here. No. Okay. So basically what somebody did for this letter, for the letter Jim, because this is a letter Jim to remember it. Okay. You can remember it like jar in English. So it looks like a jar. And the way they drew it was like, it was sealed like a jar. Okay. And you put your cookies inside the jar. <laughs> Oh, that makes sense. I'm gonna hold on. I really want to show you guys. Okay, one second. I'm gonna show you guys a picture, but I have to stop sharing my screen for a second because okay. um when I send over pictures to my um iPad, it, it opens up my um my photo gallery. <laughs> And I can't, I can't have that on the recording. So, okay. Okay. So check this out. All right. You see what they did here? Oh, yeah, yeah. It's tight. <laughs> so you have the gene. They kind of drew like a jar. So you can remember the J sound and there's supposed to be a cookie inside the jar. Okay, so when I said from now on, when you see a cookie inside, it's a J, a uh, G, G. Okay, so let's try this again now. Go ahead. I can't see. Oh, yeah. Go for it. Jim, Fathad, Ja. Jim, Kasra, G. Mm-hmm. Try not to make these long, by the way. One common mistake that people do in this lesson is they elongate things like G, Ju. If you do that, you'll see why it's wrong in one of the upcoming lessons because these are all short vowels. As soon as you make it a little bit long, you made it a long vowel. And a long vowel, us saying G, Ju is actually another lesson. So if you do that here, you're basically 
mixing it up with another lesson. You're, you're saying it wrong. So try it as best as possible to make it as short as possible. J, G, like, okay. G, G, Doma, Ju. All three? Yeah. Ja, Jin, Ju. Ja, Ji, Ju. Ja, Ji, Ju. Okay, next. Sheen, Fatha, Sha. Sheen, Kasra, Shi. Sheen, Doma, Shu. Sha, Shi, Shu. Mm -hmm. Okay, sister. Ya, Kasra, Ya. Mm -hmm. The first one. Fatha. Ya Fathaya, Ya Kasrayi, Ya Doma, you, Ya Yi, you, Ya Yi, you, Ya Yi, you. Okay, that's not Fad Fatha. No, excuse me, that's Dod. Right, sorry. The, dot, the way to remember it is there's a dot on top. There's a dot on top. Go ahead. Bad fatha dua. Again. Bad fatha dua. Try to remove the W in your dad. It sounds like you're saying dua. Okay. Bad fatha dua dua. No. Okay. There's no wo in there. Dua. Put your tongue to the back. Hey. Okay. Your side of your tongue should try to hit the top molars. Okay. Dua. Law and just keep it flat. Imagine it like so. You what you're doing is you're putting the W at the beginning. You're saying wad D W A. You're putting the W first. The W comes at the end. Wad A A W sound. A sound. Not dwa sound. Don't put the W at the start. Okay. Okay. Wad wad wad. Okay. Okay. Wad wad wad. Yeah, it's like in Bosnian, da. You the equivalent would be for you, you're basically kind of like saying dwa, dwa. But it's very subtle, it's not that clear. Obviously, you're not putting that much of a W, but I'm hearing a bit of a dwa sound in there. Okay. We try again. Oh. Again. Bad fatha ba. When you say ba, it's fine, but when you're saying the letter, you're still saying ba a little bit. Keep it flat. Ba, ba, ba. Think of it like double A's, triple A's. Okay. Bad fatha ba. Again. Bad fatha ba. Better, much much better. Okay, yo, let's just, uh, yeah. To finish them, hold on. There's two more. Bad kasra. Boy, no, you heard that? That was boy, boy. No, it this is very hard. This one is very hard because it's like a D sound, it still has to be E. Okay, bod kesra, di, di. Okay, di, bod kesra, di. Not doi, boy. Try to get this one. You have to remove the W altogether. Okay, there's no W in this one. It's so hard in my tongue. This one is very hard. Say, say D, D. It has to be the same. You see how it's smooth, just e, but with a dod sound. D, D. Yeah, it takes some work. Okay, this one is difficult. You know, you want to remove that w sound altogether. Yo, do the last one. Okay. Dod, dama, do, 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 do. Kind of. Yeah. Yeah. yeah good. <laughs> Go ahead, sister. It's tough, honestly. When I was practicing in my other class, this is the letter I struggled with. Bald is one of the hardest letters. Bald is, to be honest, bald is not that difficult, in my opinion. Maybe with the kesra, it's quite it's quite difficult. But raw is the hardest one that you're gonna come and see. Yellow sister, go ahead. Lam kesra la. Mm -hmm. Oh my god. Okay. Lam Fathala Lam Kasra Li La Dhamma Lu La Li Lu. Stop saying La Li Lu. You're getting into like a little rhythm. 
And that's what's making you make it long because you're going la li lu. Say la li lu. Break it up. Okay, don't say it all in one. La li lu. There you go. Because when you keep it all in one flow, you end up stretching it by accident. La li lu. Okay, go ahead. Asna. Noon fatha na. Noon kasra ni. Noon dhamma nu. Na ni nu. Good. Sister, before you do the next one, can you just say these three for me? Say, do, 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 do. Okay. Yeah, yours, yours was just a bit, bit light. The kesra one, you, it sounded more like a D, like a, the letter D in English or dad. Okay, but you're not, the good thing is you're not adding a dwi in there. You're not going dwi. Okay, you're just saying D. So it could be a bit heavier. Dwi. Dwi. Go ahead. Do you... Sorry. I'm sorry. Sorry. Do... It's okay. All right, go ahead. Do the next one. I got a joke for you after class. Oh, maybe for after class when the recording is off. All right, go ahead. Stop. Can't control her laughter. All right, Asna, if you do this one for me quickly, let her calm down. Oh, yeah, this is hot. Pa, fetha, pa. Pa, kasra, pi. Yeah. Even this one with the kesso is very difficult. Okay. Just avoid, you said it better the first time. When you said the first time it wasn't bad. Just avoid that tweet sound. Just keep it kesso. Two, three, two, three, two. Okay, sister. Ra. 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 Fatha. Ra. Ra. Kasra. Ri. Yeah, this is light. When Ra has a kasra, it's it's light. Okay. Ra. Kasra. Ri. 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 Ra. Dama. Not dhamma. Remember the the that that symbol, the haraka is called dhamma with a dot. Ra dhamma ru. Ra dhamma ru. Ra ri ru. Very good. Okay, asnaf. Dal fatha da. Dal kasrati. Da dhamma. Dal. When you say the letter, the name of the letter, it has an L at the end, okay? Dal kasradi, dal dhammadu, dal dhammadu, da di du. Perfect. All right, I think that's enough for today. We'll stop here and uh, probably see you guys tomorrow, inshallah. All right. Wa alaikum salam. Jazakumullah khairan.